So we had a good night's sleep last night. We noticed we can't uh, turn the AC all the way to blue. Otherwise, it'll freeze up the, the air conditioner. But Jen has also decided that she likes sleeping on the, on the dinette. Looks a lot better. Caroline getting her sleep on. Brennan did good. Added the vent deflector thing. So Jim was able to pour it down on herself since she froze Caroline out last night. And something else that we notice is we go through a lot of gray tank water. So I don't know if you can see the water coming up from the shower. Yeah, that's what happens when you fill a gray tank up all the way. So I'm about to go drain that. So Jen will get off of me. Thanks. Um, so we're trying the hash browns for the first time. Sounds look Barry's making the face of approval. Mm. Got some eggs cooked up here for the girl. This is how we're doing our doing news. A hearty breakfast of bacon, eggs, hash browns, and biscuit with jelly. Mm. And orange juice. And berry. Alright, since the uh, 28 gallon has a crack in it, we're back to using the 21 gallon. And I'm going to be flying solo today. Barry's getting other stuff done, so I get to go take the dump by myself. They see me rolling, they hating, but it's rolling, riding dirty. Look at me, I'm riding dirty. Ah, the old dump station getting quite familiar with. Alright, so we all hooked up. Time to get our Get our dump on. Oh yeah. Ooh, gotta do my vent. Just cool flow. Oh yeah, you gotta take this vent off right there and it flows fast. So this morning, Sunday morning, we're heading to Mount Nebo. Up there is the one we've been looking at from across the lake. Dark now. Anyway, there's cows and stuff, so Brennan likes that this direction. So, Goofy's back there. Excited to get out and do another round of hiking. Yeah! So there's three. This say? is yeah. There's three um, high peaks in this area known as the Arkansas River Valley, and they are Pettit Jean, Mount Nebo, and Mount Magazine. So we did Pettit Jean yesterday. We're doing Mount Nebo today, and then we're coming back for uh, Labor Day weekend in September to do Mount Magazine. Ah, so we're gonna do the trifecta this year. So uh, here's, so at the top of Mount Nebo, since you really can't pull a trailer up, it is so steep. They do a lot of primitive camping. You know, there's no trailers allowed higher than, what, 24 foot we saw? Yeah. Yeah. Well, since we have no idea where we're going, we're going to drive through the campground. Oh, there's a big parking lot right here. Maybe we'll just park there. And we'll talk with her. Oh. We need to go to the visitor center. I was probably wrong. Oh, a little kid running across. Is oh, that the visitor kid. center? I don't know. Oh, there's a pool. Yeah. Man. Maybe we should park up. I bet that's the visitor. You think that's the visitor center? Mount Nebo. All right, we're going to stop here. So we are at the Mount Nebo State Park Visitor Center. New park by Stacy. All right, so we're up here in Mount Nebo, the Civilian Conservation Corps, coming out to see. I guess this is the Washita Valley, maybe? I don't know. That should be, I'm assuming maybe Lake now. Aren't we somewhere? I don't know, but this is incredible. Wow video just does not do it justice wow
So we're out here on the top of Camp Nebo. Tell how it, okay. Yeah, it is Camp Nebo. Bo's, no. It is Nebo. So Jen is signing a sign-in log for visitors who have been here in the past. That's cool. So we're gonna go up into the visitor center, get us a map, see where we're gonna walk. Here's the visitor center. Oh, big nice chimney. Pictures, bathrooms. All right, so we're gonna do the rim trail, wherever that is. I don't even see a rim trail, but anyway, that's what we're doing. Here. Wow. Okay, now going down. There, I'm assuming. Cool um, actually, I got a video on the stairs. Yeah, where the girls going down. It's just so beautiful. This doesn't do it do justice, really. Look right here. Ooh. That's what I'm talking about. Wow. I wore different socks than yesterday. This is so cool. Jen, seriously, you're going to change socks no, now? No, I'm not changing socks. I'm just adjusting them. So here's remnants of something, and then here is the clearing we saw. We actually came up that road coming from Lake Dardanelle, which is off there to the left. So they, I guess, carved a, carved a. Move it up. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That is neat. Oh, there's a plaque. We're still on the correct trail. You can tell by the yellow. A little cave in the side. This is cave is spring? spring. Natural spring. Oh, it does have a natural spring dripping in it. Whoa. What serves as a source of drinking water? For the what? Of Look at that. That little puddle. Whoa. That is so cool. You wouldn't think that this high of elevation it would have water coming out of it. But well, I guess. Drink a source of drinking water. It's got I mean, a source of drink. Very tasty. And <laughs> let's let us know if you get diarrhea. Yeah. <laughs> it used to be a source of drinking oh, water. Oh, there's probably a reason for that. <laughs> wow. I would love to have that home and be able to look out over this. Oh, goodness. Beautiful. Uh, it's an Arkansas, it's 1,350 feet. On a hike and Barry's on the phone. Oh. So we actually can see on top of another hill of some sort. I don't know, I wonder if that... Jen said she wonders if that's Pettit Jean, because I know Pettit Jean's flat. But, well, I know you can see Nebo. Yeah, maybe that's Pettit Jean off in the distance right there. There's the runway. The runway? Oh, the straight? Yeah. So we just uh, dropped the girls off at the pool so we can just continue to walk and enjoy this beautiful scenery. And our um, oh my. Ooh, nice, oh. steep. Oh, this is nice. Oh. This is really nice. Pretty. Oh, pretty fun little stair step. And we're going to head that a ways. So, so, just discovered a cold rock. Yeah, very cold, and we think it must be coming from up under. This literally feels like an AC unit, kind of, with uh, a gentle blow right here. I'm going to stick my tongue to it. 
to it and it did not stick. Oh, uh, his stone did not stick. A la Christmas story. Uh, we can get all the rocks up there. Wedged in there. Not. Well, I'm not climbing out there. It's pretty neat though. It's probably like 40 feet deep. Huh? Then you can kind of see where that one used to really. fit. Is it cool? Like the other I side? Really like from yeah. underneath there. Oh, and there's big old oh, ants. Oh, yes, it broke big off. Big old right ants? There's ants all over it. No way. I want to see. I wouldn't yeah. say all over it, but uh, it made it a little traumatic. But look, they're big ones. They're good. They went in the yeah, holes. Oh. They went in. They're rocking ants, huh? So, got another spot that has opened up to a beautiful area. That's an interesting that? hill. That's it's really good. Like right in the middle. Yeah, there's a clearing in the middle of the flat top there. That is so cool. Trails leading up to it. So here's another open area. Get out the side. There's a spot we just looked at. Wow. So glad. So we can go up there. I mean, look at that. This is incredible. Oh yeah, we so got a selfie. A hawk right there, getting his glide on. What do I need a stick for? I'm not the one sliding all over the place. So there's another hill right there, but we're not sure which one that is. It's beautiful though. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous. Oh, thanks. Nice. A big cave here. Yeah. This is pretty area found the ladies down to the gum gum falls I said so we're on the we're on the black trail for just a little bit so we can cut off a little time get to the falls so we're not sure if this is gum falls or not but it's pretty we think it is Here's the gum fall. Come down, we're gonna step across here. Look down off that direction. I'm filming Barry filming me. <laughs> yeah, so we can walk down to this little viewing angle. Looks like there's a pretty good drop off. Coming off the end. Oh, and there is somebody down there. We had a debate about a uh, a path we could have taken to go down there. We elected not to. All right, so Barry says the water is cool and refreshing. Ooh, it is. I'm gonna get my hat wet so I can get me a little, a little air conditioning going on. Alright, so we backtracked over here to go see the falls from the bottom. Oh yeah, this is so worth coming back to see. Pretty. And it kind of goes off down the mountain. Alright, so this is called Lover's Leap. And I don't know why anybody would want to leap over this. Because frankly... This is terrifying. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're gonna take a selfie.
Nice little stone bridge, a little waterfall right there. It's pretty. Just a little waterfall and down the hill. Man, you just can't tell on video the three dimensions, you know? It's just, yeah. you can't tell that it's steep and you can't tell that it's... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Hey, what y'all doing? Microphone on this camera is picking up the oh, wind. Yeah. Little cave. On our little, um, Look, the little waterfalls. Huh? What? He says waterfalls. Need to look at the map. You see waterfalls here? Yeah. Right. Okay. Oh, we're on the wrong side of the hill, I bet. Be careful. Keep on turning. We may want to go up. Well, I think that's Black Trail. Is this going to go down there? What's that next Look to the map? There's green. We want to go up. I know that we if we want to get to Yellow Trail. Yeah. So the green is right. The pool here is the pool at the. This is an old bathhouse. An old bathhouse? Oh. Cool. We're on the back end, man. That was a three mile hike. Oh, yeah. Oh. It's just to make them for your rooms, your doors. Going down from Mount Nebo. So here we are. We are at the BFD. I don't know what that stands for. Like Burr. I don't know. And Emily, uh, right, Brennan, trying to fall down. Brennan. Oh, Brennan, somebody. Uh, little, oh, look at your ice cream. Uh, we'll stop that. So much cream powder. And it's a lot of food. She's getting a french fries. Yeah. I'm missing out. So, Barry's missing out, so he's swinging around so he can see the people. He just pulled up as well. They just, uh, Trying to be inconspicuous. Those people just chilling and hanging out. 29. All right, so now we are warming up. No! <laughs> <laughs> warming up our pizzas. Oh. So here's the girls. We can get them set. Cool, Barry's got his it's, over there. It's not burning either. It's, it's just. We can sprinkle them down on ours. The other two are pretty girls. Got some pepperonis and some olives. Ooh. Mm. It's still hot. Too. Crispy. <laughs> what you think, Jim? Good? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ooh, Stacy likes. 
Stacy likes. Let me see if I like. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh. That's hot. Mm. It's good though. I'm glad my box phone's clean. Got the fishing game here. Over here. This is a section we haven't been in yet. Somebody's coming in from this fishing. They had a big old fishing tournament today when Barry and I were riding our bikes. No lake is fit unless it has a nuclear reactor on the other side of it. So after a long day at Mount Nebo and hanging out, we are putting in for the night. Jen's getting her shower. I'm going to get mine. And then we're going to try to hit out first thing in the morning after a good hearty breakfast. So last morning making a good hearty breakfast. Webs over there. We're about to pack up and get rolling. Um, awesome trip. Great. Petagene was awesome. Got to see some good hiking stuff. Um, Mount Nebo. I mean, just breathtaking. Both both days were wonderful. Um, memories we're getting with the kids are, you know, just just incredible. So, um, yeah, about to finish off these eggs, get the girls up, and start rolling. So really, the only thing I would Criticize, I guess, if anything, it's not really a criticism, but the flies, good lord, they have a lot of flies out here. Can't leave anything out because there'll be fly on it within a few seconds, but next time I'll bring my assault rifle, shoot salt at them, that'd be fun. Prime hunting out here for that.